I forgot to make more healing items, huh? I have a lot of, like, damage ups. But I wonder... If, so if I use the damage ups, will they affect the construct? Oh, whoops. That was down below. I like how it's literally a pixel that makes a difference. So chat, do you watch any anime? I've been watching some anime. I've been watching this one called Freerun Freerun no Soso. Uh I'd seen a couple of memes about it. Late uh mostly the one about L like an LTG moment. I thought it was going to be some kind of like over the top gory anime, but it I mean it it's actually a pretty good anime. It's probably like my favorite anime of the year so far. All right, so we need to find a cook pot real quick. We'll just go to here because there's always a cook pot. Time to cook. I was actually surprised that I was expecting a fifth dungeon, but the dungeon was actually just assembling the robot. <sighs> Gloom resistance. Oh, while I'm at it, let me check something. Oh, there it is, the X button. Lizard. Lizard nail and a bunch of horns. Do I even have a lizard? I have one. Lizard. Horblin. We'll make the last of it. Seems good. Okay. So is she just gonna teleport down here? There she is. All right. We should be fine. I have like a shit ton of health and a shit ton of healing and a shit ton of revives.
Cage match? Cage match? Cage match. Whoa, that thing looks cool. That construct, I made it long ago. But the glow, it must be under the control of something monstrous. If the Demon King has turned my creation into his pawn, we must defeat it. We can do this together, Link. Let's go. We have to stop that construct. Right, I've been mean I meant to check this to see how well does this work. Oh, did I round two? Oh no, it's Giga powering up. More arm. Oh shit, more arm. Kind of reminds me of that one boss from Skyward. My health! We will not be able to close our way to its defenses. Huh? Yeah, no worries, Louise. Yeah, apparently I'm doing this fight. Whoa, what the heck hit me? Huh? Any more of those spike balls? How in the world? Hit the wall, will you? Eat. There we go. I think I accidentally shot off my bow.
You get semi-useless mech. Yeah, I didn't... I like the... I like how she just sort of plays with the mechanics a little bit, but it's annoying because of how slow she is. Even with a fan on her back, she's still super slow. Hmm. Oh, dang. Oh, that's what it was, yeah. Mostly used to cross gloom, that's what I figured. But I have my ways around gloom. I got all the memories already, so it's really weird that Link doesn't tell anybody that Zelda's the dragon. It's like, anybody gonna tell anybody that the, the Link, you know the Zelda's the dragon, why aren't you telling anybody where Zelda is? It's so freaking weird. I mean, yeah, he told Impa, but even Impa's like, well, we don't know what to do about it. Now I'm going to tell you exactly what happened with the other five guys. I'm glad to meet you, Link. We, I, we already told you the story four times. We're going to tell you a fifth I must time. Thank you. It is because of you that we have recovered my secret stone. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Porapad, then to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same construct. You have proven quite adept, and I am grateful for all your efforts. Link, here. Take this. <gasps> Holding hands? That's pretty In lewd. Of Minoru, sage of spirit, I grant my power unto you. I believe it will serve you well. Oh, so Link gets the stone from her. That's cool. Or he, she's just bar letting him bum her power. Oh, okay. So it is. Yeah, just bumming her power. With this power I've given, a deep bond has been forged between us. And from Why can't I just get your stone? He has all the infinity stones. He, that is true. He can just snap away Ga Ganondorf now. Snaps. Or, yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. She was hiding in Pura's pad the entire time? So she moved from one thing to another? Uh -huh. I mean, yeah, she has two stones. Or she ate her stone. I'm thinking it's Ganon who has the two stones. He yoinked somebody's stone. Came down from the heavens to the surface of the kind of what so it, they were descended where's the triforce of power in all this they bore treasures from these same where's the triforce at all stones like nobody has the triforce the triforce just sort of got thrown out them. it's like Gan it's like um Dragon Ball Z leveling of power of Zonai, my younger we went Rocky beyond triforce a great leader he met a young woman named Sonia and they would wed yeah exactly what triforce Raru gifted Sonia one of the secret stones. 
Together, they sought to establish their kingdom. This is how the Kingdom of Hyrule, with Rauru and Sonya as its first king and queen, came to be. The future looked bright. But then that mean old Ganon showed However, up. Tragedy suddenly struck. A man of great evil emerged from the desert. The leader of the Gerudo, Ganondorf, killed Queen Sonya and stole her secret stone. Using the secret stone, Ganondorf transformed into the Demon King. He then created swarms of monsters and attacked. Saving it for rose up to Triforce. Threats, but the evil power drives the Triforce Force, like Legend of Zelda, the, the Triforce Force. The brink of defeat. Infinity Triforce Wars. Raru then came up with a plan to turn the tide of the war. In the next game, he Link is going to go to a multiverse and he's going to meet other versions of himself. They became sages and united in an effort to finally defeat the Demon King. Raru and the sages outnumbered the Demon King and should have been able to stop him. However... The Demon King's power had grown far beyond anything we could have imagined. I was unable to withstand his strength. Our fight appeared all but lost. And then, Rauru. Our only weakness, fighting him in a pitch black cave. He sacrificed himself by sealing him away. He committed himself to one final act. <laughs> no, you can't be doing that and nobody knows what he's doing. So I guess they wasted all their money on the Ganondorf actor, and that's why all the other actors are kind of just not that good. Yeah, I think the dialogue kind of just sucks too. You're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the darkness. A swordsman with the power to defeat you, Link. Remember this name. Link. Interesting. And then at some point in the future, Rauru's body just sort of disintegrates, leaving behind only his hand. Hmm. Uh -huh. I like how it's all voice acted, and then I go back to reality, and it's like, nah ha. Well then. Mm-hmm.
in case it wasn't obvious to you, time travel. I'm just gonna skip. Please fix Link's sword. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Well then. Aha. Uh -huh. Well then. Well then. Naha. Uh -huh. Well then. I already have the Master Sword. I guess it's... <laughs> Never mind. She tells me where the Master Sword is, and is like, I already had it, though. The time is at hand. Go to Pura. Okay. I wonder if this is going to give me the option to go to Kakariko now. Because, like, I remember there was, like, a bunch of things happening at Kakariko, but I couldn't really do anything. This was, like, a hundred hours or so ago. Well, I mean, I say a hundred hours ago. I got this game, like, the day it came out, and then I just never finished it, and I've been slowly just going through it. Check it. Yeah, the durability thing bugs me with the Master Sword specifically. I'm fine with durability on the other weapons. It's just that... Does this... Okay, so this thing's already got something, I think, infused. Yeah, it's got a Construct Horn fused to it. I need more weapons. You already confirmed the sword? When was I planning to tell you? I had the sword for a really long time now. Why is it so surprising? Hmm. <laughs> I pulled it out of her forehead. I mean, a dragon forehead. Yeah, the plan is I'm just going to try to beat it now. I'm assuming I am like super close to the end. Josha, for any info she may have, she's enthusiastic about investigating the depths. Yeah. Hey, Salty Beaver Boy. Destroy Ganondorf, the first mission from the very- from Breath of the Wild. I thought I just showed her this. So I gotta go there, I guess. I think that's what they're asking me to do. Chasm in the forest of time south of Hyrule. Field. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. So it's like, why is it pointing at her then? Oh. 
So why is it pointing at her if that's... Maybe I just gotta talk to her again? Let me see. Go to the Great Mines? Oh. Okay. The Great Abandoned Mine. Daffin's Canyon Mine. Is it just telling me to go to... Well, like, I know exactly where to check, probably. Mm -hmm. Southwest. From what I told you about the statues that seem to head southwest. <laughs> statues that head southwest. So, like, down here. The abandoned Gerudo mine, maybe? Desert Coliseum. Okay, I'm gonna check Kakariko then. Where's Hot now? Kakariko was over here. Let me see if I can do anything over here now. Yeah, I tried to do them, I remembered, and like an old man or something got mad at me and wouldn't let me approach. See if the games let me progress any further. I'm literally the hero of legend, please let me pass. What the heck was that? My game like lagged ultra hard in the space like that. Hey, Mr. Cyberbrute. Mm -hmm. Imposter Among Us? Stone slab inside engraved with Zonai script. Mm. So is, if the, that old man gone now, or are they still gonna not let me go? Okay, nice. I was surprised I could go up at that height. Uh, there it is. Easy. 
don't, don't I need to like take a photo of this? Yeah. I actually don't know how many of these ruins I've actually looked at. I think this is maybe the first one. Read this sideways. Ah. Ah. Southeast and trust future wish defeat Demon King. There's some lettering I can't figure out before Southeast, but Minero seems to be someone's name. Dragon land southeast. There's a site in Farron that has long been known as the Zonai Ruins. It predates ruins falling from the sky, home to many ancient relics. Wait, is it that one? I think I know where they're asking me to go. Zonai Ruins and Farron. Mm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I guess Paya is going to stay here and be Paya. Yeah. the wrong button. I beat the new Mario Wonder off stream. Uh, first tried the final boss. But I died a hundred times on that one secret level. <laughs> Here you are, Kellop, but where's the other oh. guy? Oh. Starting in round Dracozu Lake. Go southeast and you'll find the Zonite Ruins. Oh.
Oh, down there. Okay. The Shrine of Courage down there. Yeah, we... I was already in the Shrine of... I already went down here before, I thought. I guess I can run. I mean, I could use the bike. I was like, what the hell is that noise? I thought I was back to playing Lethal Company again. That looks like that's where he is over there. Yeah, there's the giant dragon maw into the shrine. That actually, yeah, I think that's him right there. Okay. Where the electric garb hidden at long-necked dragons along the wide-mouthed forest serpent. What do they mean by forest serpent and dragon? Mm -hmm. The call to mind the tall pillars found around these ruins designed to look like dragons. Forest serpent, though, I haven't seen any designs like that. Forest serpent. Oh. Offer a zonite charge to the altar at the tail. Oh. And then there was a chest up there. Oh. So that's interesting. I never would have thought that the chests were hard coded for me specifically. Charged shirt. I think I have another piece of this already, but I might be wrong. Nope, okay. Stormy weather attack. Looks kind of cool. Let me see if he says anything about it. Yeah, he does! That's actually kind of nice. Yeah, they said something about wearing this thingamajig. Oh. Mm. Oh. Yeah, maybe there are other treasures containing the rest of the garments. Oh. Searching for treasure chests without a plan. Oh, oh the sensor plus? Okay. That's actually kind of nice that they, they actually took into consideration the sen uh, a sensor. Uh, do I have a picture of a chest? Let me see. I do, but I'm going to take a picture of it again. So that way I, I can just easily take a... Yeah, I know how to speak. Ah. Oh. Oh. 
What was it again? Aww. It was wear the electric garb, offer Zenite charge the altar at the tail. The tail pillars found around these tall pillars found around these ruins have dragon designs, but does that bit about tra forest serpent mean? Mm -hmm. mm. mm. Alright. I guess the mouth of the dragon is over there. And then he said the river is pillars. Like, maybe these things. I see your Lizelle foes. For a second there, I thought I heard a whiz robe laughing, but no, it's just bird noises. Treasure chest. Up here? Below. Okay. Jumped and that didn't do anything. Easy enough. Thick stick sword. So it seems like it would be like right here. Yeah, like that that looks like it's it's pointing me right here. There's an opening over there. I wonder if you could have I guess you could have just found this while looking. Okay, so we're looking for these giant pillars. Huge pillars. How did that look on the map? Like that. There's another one over here.
charged trousers. The hell is that on his head? Uh, did he die? Oh no, he moved over there? Yeah, that's him. Oh, that was a silver Lazolfo, okay. Alter at tail. Okay, so mouth is... That's the mouth. So maybe the tail is at the end of the river, maybe? Like down here? I... I guess. I'm not sure, because it's kind of weird that the mouth is there, but it's facing the opposite direction. So that's probably, they're probably like saying, this is the mouth right here. This big giant gaping area with like a lake bed. And then the tail's all the way down there. Seems like I'm going the right way. It is raining. Blood moon.
I'm gonna put my normal armor back on then. Oh no, Blood Moon. And I just killed everything. Well, round two, I guess. Yeah, it is round two. You guys can fight him if you want. I'm going over here. This looks like it's the place. We'll try it. Uh, so I went up there already. I walked oh. through it when it was completely storm ridden, so I couldn't see anything. So at least now I get to see what's up there. Yeah, so this was the thing right here. Dragonhead Island. Oh, I forgot my charge. Minus one. Well, at least now I get to see what's up here. Probably nothing. Get bamboozled, kiddo. Yeah, see, like, I did it already. Hmm. 
Well, that was that, apparently. I love this thing, man. It's like my favorite. See you later. It's like, yeah, you, they really can't go back to Breath of the Wild, can they? Because they just made this. It's like a better Breath of the Wild in like every way. Because Breath of the Wild was all about climbing. But this one's all about how to get across the map as fast as humanly possible. I'm... Although the fastest way to get across the map is, is probably like some kind of speed strat. Oh, the sign guy. Land so I can get some battery back. At this point, I could probably just... Hmm. I know where to go. I'm just wondering if the game tells you where to go eventually. Or if I can just preemptively go there now. I'm assuming it's like Breath of the Wild in that sense. You can just go to the boss at the very, very beginning of the game. Let's just do that then. Oh, do I have any? I, I think I have some food for upgrading or increasing damage. One full heal and several damage ups. And just like a bunch of miscellaneous foods that I can just use. Yeah, just go down here. Oh, I didn't even think. I could just use the light route. I, I went down here and a Lionel was the thing that made me not want to continue. I remember that.
It's like, hey, there's a Lionel. No thanks. I could probably fight it now. I only have like 1,200 of these things, and I don't seem to use them for anything. Yeah, there he is. Damn, that was that him. That was him shooting me. A gloom club. Yeah, this is the part where I should have brought more of those gloom thingamajigs. Just shield. That's a powerful shield. That's a good bow. Holy. Uh, what do we drop? One of these bows, I guess. 
Wait, no, the demon's demon lord or the demon king bow is actually pretty good. Not what I meant. Uh, we'll drop one of the royal guard bow be or that one. Cool. Is there a campsite nearby, I wonder? Okay, we killed that guy, but now what? <laughs> Looks like... Up here? I probably could have just avoided him if I knew that this was right here. That looks like the way forward. This was the way in. I was trying to find a cook a cooking pot, but I don't think I'm gonna find one. So I'm gonna have to like use the individual ones. Is it underneath one of these? Is that what it keeps bleeping at me? Maybe it's in the previous area or something. Yeah, I guess it's nearby below or something. While I'm at it.
Oh, a scythe. Wait, is that going to work? Hold on a second. I wonder. This isn't going to work the way that I think it's going to work. Yeah, that's what I thought. It's just going to do that. I was asking for that. Right in my face, too. Broke instantly, of course.
forgot that I had these. <laughs> Easy. I completely forgot. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. I haven't been up standing for a bit. Whoa. Model's like freaking out. Uh, eat to restore health? Okay. Man, I need to go to the bathroom again. I've been drinking a lot of water. And soda. Carrots? Stamina max. Movement speed. Savina. I have a bunch of these too for gloom resist, but I don't really need gloom resist. I can just. If I get hit, I can just. Use these. Yeah. And then, how much meat do I have? I feel like I just sort of skipped over meat. Yeah, there's meat. I got a lot of materials. I just got that. I can probably put that on the end of a spear or something. Gliok horns? I forgot about that. The four horn. Meat skewer. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, I returned. A lot of bananas. 
That seems good. Uh, and then... Oof. I don't know, a bunch of fruit? Hey, that didn't help that much. Like, what is this? Increase your heart recovery when used as an ingredient. Okay. That's much better than it was. So you need to use like three of them to get a good benefit out of it. This is like electrical resistance. Adds a whiplash attack to your things. All right. Have a good night, Mr. Cyberbrute. I'm going to try to finish this tonight. I think that's the plan, yeah. Stamina, luminescence, quiet movement, wet surface, speed, wet surface. Like, I have all these equipment things that I can put on weapons, so I should be using these. Oh, the silver moblin horn. Yeah, that's definitely a spear. And then there's the white mane Lionel. Oh no, I can put this on my Master Sword. Yeah, that'll be a good idea. We'll use this. I'll put this on the Master Sword. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. And then we'll put this on the spear. That didn't go as well as I thought it would. This looks kind of jank. So I know it's not gonna... It's gonna break after like a couple of hits. How about we try it with... A normal sword. Or maybe it's like a club thing. Let me see. I'm gonna save scum. This looks like it might go on like a great club. So like this weapon for example. No? So is it only a sword thing then? Maybe it's not even a sword thing at all. Maybe they're just like expecting you to use it on potions and stuff. Do you have any potions or food? We'll try it on the sword now. Or I could use it on the Master Sword. Yeah, it's a hammer. Okay. Hmm. Sleep for free heal. Oh, right, and then let's get some max health. Forgot about that. Like, I have all these cooking ingredients. Goron spice? Add sweetness? There they are. Hearty truffles. Let's add some luminous stone for extra spice. Hearty salted grilled mushrooms. Okay. Protect. 
protection against electricity. Kind of figured it wasn't going to do that much. Okay, we have a lot of heals. I think I'm pretty good. It is now time to fight the guy. Probably, I don't... I think it'll let me... <laughs> oh. Okay, we're going this way. Let's see what this does to a sword. Looks like it it would probably work. Yeah. Oh, Gibdos. What I meant what I meant to do was destroy the fused material and then equip another gem healing power no lightning huh I never I never went on the lightning guy That was easy. Huh. He got his resistance back.
Well, I know where I am now. I mean, I had an inkling that we were going to see this at some point, but... It... Oh, there's the door. Mega blind. Maybe I should take a photo. No? Okay. Game doesn't care. Can't place a medallion here? I can place one here, but I can't place one beyond that. Okay. place one here. <laughs> this is some very good build-up, I gotta say. I quite like how just, like, freaking spooky this is. I saved it before I got down here, so I think we should be fine. Oh. Oh, I was wondering where those guys were. So they're actually physically present. My boyfriend!
Time for 20 FPS combat. Blew myself up. Oops. Hey, you guys drop anything good? God. Well, while I'm at it, let me check. Oh, never mind. Wave change? Yeah. Oh, did that weapon not have anything equipped to it? Yeah, that's what it was. Uh-oh. Gibdo. Where is she? She's not visible? It showed her spawn, but I don't see her. There she is. No, that's boyfriend. This is weird. It's like she's not here. Okay, let's try this. Never mind. There she is.
Forgot I had the good bow equipped. I had two of these. Wow, that did nothing to you. So what's left? Oh. Moblins. That's a lot of Moblins. Gotta fight all the bosses again? Was sealed in. Spooky. Might as well. Uh, and then while I'm at it. Hey, Gira. Oh, yeah, I... This is a really fun final fight. Because, like, in the first Zelda, or the first, uh... The Breath of the Wild, it was literally just, like, you run in, and then fight the final boss. But it's like this big, epic dungeon.
Bexy Ganondorf. Bloodborne pose? Beasts all over the shop. I will reshape this world as it was meant to be. I will crush any opposition. I will rule. That is what a king must do. A king's revival. And the birth of his new world. forgotten the thrill of battle that feeling as blood surges in my veins and I am not even near the limits of my power That, that's a lot of health. I wonder. All right, I'm here. No, the sword is just straight up better, because it it actually is just doing more damage to him. I guess because he's the he's Ganon. We'll wait a little. I like how they they showed up to help. Phase two, I guess. Or phase four? Phase three? Phase three.
Oh, he knocked out my ads. I wonder if I should try parrying him. Let's try parrying. Hmm, that did not work. thinking I'm just thinking how did that There we go. He's just sleeping. How did you miss? That's cool. Phase four? Oh, he's gonna turn himself into a dragon. Is it going to be a fight very similar to the first boss, maybe? I say first boss, I mean the the fly, the one in the wind temple. So I got to like jump from cloud to cloud or something and shoot it. Yeah, giga final boss of hell. Final final boss of hell. Or it's thinking about it. It just looks like Ganon, like the, from the first game. Ooh, hand. I 
Am I gonna get a cool light bow or something for this? Oh, there he is. He tried to he tried to vor me, but it didn't work. Vor Link, I mean. Oh, there's Zelda Dragon. Do I get all my health back because of this? I mean, like, it, it took away some of my permanent health because, I guess, of the heart container thing. Yeah, epic boss fight. It looks pretty cool. Oh, am I going to get to throw beams at him? Or am I going to get the bee the dragon? Oh, I am the dragon. Uh, Zelda, where'd you go? Uh, Zelda? There you are.
Maybe his face now? Oh, there it is. on his face. Dang, man. Solar flare. That was a really good fight. I mean, it was a pretty easy fight overall, but I thought it was a really good fight, just like thematically. I guess Link is just going to be able to save Zelda now. Oh, maybe it's just Raru. 
Seems, seems like he's not having control of himself. It's probably Raru doing it. Okay. Why is my face making that? It's like I'm not doing anything and I just realized I'm like... <gasps> I'm just like this normally. <laughs> oh, they yoinked his power. Yoink? We gave you your arm back somehow. Where'd all my armor go? Link, why are you shirtless? This time he actually saves her, huh? Yeah. Because the first time he, he couldn't grab her. No, 
I understand. I had been hey, Shiro. All this time. Shiro, Shiro. But when I felt something, what's that emo? Like a warm, loving embrace. Kato. Huh? Thank you. <laughs> Link, I met such wonderful people. I saw Hyrule as it was. I have so much to tell you. So much happened. Oh, Link, I'm home. That was easy. Nice. Complete. So I assume now it's like uh, credits? No doubt unskippable credits? Oh, I could skip them. I skipped them. Okay, I skip. The after credits. Oh. Man, how does she walk in high heels everywhere? I can't believe such an impressive Her also. can float in the sky. Just when I thought I'd started to figure the zone eye out. What are those? There's my boyfriend. Everyone, he, he might be married, but I am glad I was he's still my boyfriend. Here. I wanted to share this view of Hyrule with all of you. Whoa. I've never been this far up before, Goro. Wow, what a sight it is. And Zelda, you were roaming the skies all along? Yes, although I don't really remember. I never thought I would actually stand here again. I'm kind of dead, theory, so I'm probably going to leave in a sec. See ya, and, and then she disappears. For Zelda to transform back, they both must have channeled their abilities through you, Link. Did they really need to state the obvious? They did that. I saw it. I was physically I there. I was there, but maybe you should explain it so that the class can hear. Yeah. Okay, that's kind of what I figured. She was just going to disappear. Now it seems. It is my time. Minoru! Do not worry. You have overcome the burden my era left to you. You have proven yourself. And so you what next? Are they gonna bring back Vadi? I know I can move on. He only showed up in one game, the others, but... And the world will be safe. Maybe that's what they'll do. Or the one guy from Link to the Past? I don't know. I think of Vadi and I'm thinking of Vadi Vidya. Vadi Vidya is going to be the final boss of the next game. Just watch. Those of us gathered here swear on our lives to support the princess and <laughs> They don't need to do that, do they? Kind of cringe. They're posting cringe. To support Princess Zelda and seek her on the land of Hyrule. I need like a GIF. I need like a, a playable button that I can hit. And it'll just be that that video of Spike saying to Faye, "You didn't really need to post that. You didn't." 
Ravel and Sonia will be happy to hear of this. Some of this uh, dialogue's kind of cringe. But... I will I say, though, Ganon was like the best voice Just actor in the game. All the other voice actors were alright. It's like Ganon, Zelda, and then everybody else is like on the same tier after that. Like, it's nice that Nintendo thought to do voice acting, but they should have did better, honestly. $70 for this, by the way. And the voice acting sounds like something I heard in, like, The Walking Dead Destinies or whatever. That really bad Gollum-like game that came out. It's called Gollum Likes now. The when they release a a really shitty aftermarket movie game, like it's really weird how a lot of those kinds of games have just been released like this year. You got Gollum, you got uh, King Kong, and then that Walking Dead game. It's like Walking Dead ended already, right? There hasn't been a King Kong movie in like years. The ancient sages. The voice the acting is different. Yeah, I could have listened to like the Japanese one, couldn't I? But for it to see I could have just stopped complaining and switched to another language. I will dedicate myself to that goal. I'm gonna be the same when it comes to the new Yakuza game. I think that's what is gonna happen. I'm gonna just play the Japanese dub because uh, Kiryu sounds awful, like straight up. I already think the English actor is gonna just not friends, not do a very good job of it. With all of your strength, like he just doesn't have the right cadence for Kiryu. Why didn't they just use the guy from Z Seven? Like it makes no sense. Oh, take care, Shiro. I'm probably gonna go to bed now soon. Not much else I want to play at the moment. I finally got Zelda done after like half a year. I just sat on it and never finished it. Overall, really good game. I think this is like my, um, this is like one of my two favorite games of the year so far. The other game being Lethal Company. I really, really like Lethal Company. Who's going to make the next Lethal Company like, I wonder? So guys, guys, people like extraction looters, except, uh, funny. It's an extraction game. All right, well, that's going to be it for me. Uh, if I had to rate this game out of 10, I would say it's like a 9 out of 10. The only reason it, I have a bit of a smirch is because of the story, which is, it's weird that they put such emphasis on presentation, but they didn't put much emphasis on the story. Story is kind of just poorly told. I don't like the fact that they keep telling you the same thing over and over again every time you complete dungeons. Um, again, voice acting, I'm not going to hold the voice acting against the game because I could easily just switch voice acting. But other than that, really like the world. I don't mind. I didn't mind that they just reused the same world again because the world was actually very different. Like, sure, it's the same place, but the places are different. Like there was just different things in every area. There were new things to do, new things to explore. The building was bit amazing. I love the building. Building is like the coolest thing in this game. It's not like Minecraft building, but it's like, I just, I like it. It's, it's a really novel, ingenious way of just expanding upon Breath of the Wild. Because like now, I don't think I'd ever be able to go back to Breath of the Wild. I'm just being honest. Because Breath of the Wild is like a completely different kind of game. I don't know. 